What's up guys, I'm DragonBees, and it's time for the next episode of Season 2 of Pokemon. Um, we are now watching the second half of the fight with Blaine in at Cinnabar Island, um, and it left on a cl uh, cliffhanger with Pikachu about to be barbecued. Um, so we're going to go in and watch that. It is a, uh, the, the, This is a good episode, this one. I do remember this one quite vividly. Do, 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 do. But yeah, um, the last episode was good. This is the better of the two. Obviously. Team Rocket caused a problem. Surprise, surprise. Team Rocket caused a problem. Um, which causes the volcano to become an issue. Which destroys poor old Blaine's gym. So they end up fighting in the uh, mouth of the volcano. This is a, this is a, this is probably one of my favorite episodes of the Kanto saga. <clears throat> I think it's called Volcanic Panic. Imagine how warm it would be down there, though. Oh, that music. Every time. Dun-dun. 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 It's like some of the most iconic music for me in this in this series. There's a correction. It used fire spin, not ember. Also, the whole thing about... Oh, here we go. The whole thing about uh, the lightning rod situation still bug it bugs me a lot. It is Volcanic Panic. I thought it was. <laughs> oh. Ah, oh, it's back. It's all like singed. Oh dear. I love how Blaine just puts his wig back on. Aww. Just give it a shampoo. Team, what is Team Rocket doing? Oh, they're listening. Oh, they're adjusting to the heat. <laughs> I 
So they, f they, yeah, they freeze the volcano, but the the drastic change in temperatures causes it to crack, which is what causes the volcanic eruption. <laughs> My God. Mount Vesuvius? Yeah. That's right, that's right. Real life locations were retconned out of the series. No, was it, it, yeah, they were out of the series in season two, I think. Or like Johto. Gen 2. Gen 2, yeah. <coughs> it was retconned in season two. Why did they talk about it in season yeah, two? Yeah, exactly. They managed to freeze it, but then it melts. Magma does not give a shit. Yeah, so this yeah, so it causes the volcano to crack because of the drastic change in temperatures. So this makes sense. Thermal expansion. Yeah, this makes sense. <laughs> Ice in a volcano, that's freezer burn. <laughs> Oh, God. <clears throat> oh, here we go. Yeah, it's falling apart. <laughs> Well, poor Blaine's gym is getting destroyed. Which also is a thing in Gen 2 of the game. Blaine's gym is destroyed in Gen 2, and he's taken his gym to um, the Sea Foam Islands. Well, there they go. Through the roof. Well, here it comes. <clears throat> Oh, 
It's gonna try and... Oh my god! <laughs> Only a fire type, then Brock starts using rock types. Which makes sense as well, but you know, they were like, you know, only a fire type. Oh god. Charizard helps, but only because it sees Magmar as a competitor. Nap time. <laughs> Magmar's not quick enough on its own. <clears throat> Magmar's such a weird looking Pokemon. Say Electabuster's looks weirder. I'm not sure why it's got, like, duck lips. Oh, here we go. There's some classic Pokemon music. <laughs> okay, I'm going to point out something here in a minute. Suddenly, suddenly Brock's like, hang on. Why didn't he do this first? Oh, so this makes no sense. Oh my god, Psyduck. Why is Jigglypuff there? Also, I want to point out, they're like, Starmie and uh, Squirtle can keep you cool. The whole point is not to keep them cool in this situation. <laughs> what, what? I guess it's a dude who doesn't melt. Hmm. But then, wouldn't that weaken them? <laughs> you, you want dude or lava dude? <laughs> lava dude. Magma dude. Oh, oh, Togepi. Oh, Togepi. Ah, <laughs> oh, anyone want boiled eggs? Oh, there's Pikachu. Yes, yeah, so there's, a, there's a rivalry here. That's the only reason Charizard battles Magma. This would have been cool if they did this in Johto instead of sending him to Seafoam, is that his gym is at the top of the volcano, because this is a cool looking arena. <laughs> I 
<laughs> no, I want to fight him. <laughs> Okay, Ash, calm down. It's okay. You breathe. <laughs> I don't remember when Charizard starts listening. It's a while. If I remember correctly, Charizard costs Ash's match in the in the Indigo League. I'm pretty sure. Oh. There's the music. Down, 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 down. Oh. I love the fact that Charizard is literally deflecting a fire blast. He's like holding it. And he, I think from memory, he just goes, Hoo! Yep. <laughs> Also impressive that Magmar did Skull Bash when there's not a lot of spots to run on in that. Oh, here it comes. Oh. <laughs> oh god this battle this battle is so good this is one of the early battles that is really memorable That's right, it goes for Seismic Toss. That's right. The fact that it actually starts to listen to him here is kind of cool, but it's still not, you know. From memory, it gets out of the volcano and then just falls over. Yeah.
Still doesn't listen to him properly. Sadly, can relate to that recently with my uh, sword, uh, sword uh, playthrough, dragon only type, dragon type only playthrough. My Dratini has stopped to... Uh, Blaine just takes his wig off. I take my wig off to you, shiny bald head. It's a good episode, though. It is a good episode. Oh my god. <laughs> He's got one more. <laughs> the bike. So now they go all the way. Oh, God. <laughs> God. The color puns. Oh, what a good episode, though. The, the thing I love about that episode is it's one of the first episodes, don't get me wrong, there's been some other sort of good battles in the Kanto era, but that one's probably one of the most iconic. It's just such a good battle um, by by that, like, stamp or that era's standard, because obviously battles now are even more, you know, animated and, you know, whatever else, but, like, the music as well is very on point, so... But, yeah, if you enjoyed that, you can check out the rest of the reactions on the playlist. Uh, I also reacted to all of Season 1. And I'm reacting to current stuff, so aim to be a Pokemon Master is uh, still happening. Um, also, uh, I do stream on YouTube two or three times a week, and then Twitch, um, twitch.tv slash dragonbees. Um, and yeah, let me know what you think of the episode, because the episode is really good. It's one of my favourites from the Kanto era. Um, so, yeah. But, uh, and make sure you subscribe to the channel. Click the notification bell. Then you know when videos go live. But until the next video, thanks for watching, guys, and I'll see you then. Bye!